Columbus, Georgia. And we got the crowd pleaser. We're at this nice restaurant called Smokey Bones right now. And we have the crowd pleaser. I keep saying it because it's so good, it's delicious. But we got the crowd pleaser and it has uh, loaded baked potato, uh, not loaded baked potato, loaded fries. We have onion rings, we have um, chicken fingers, and we have nachos. And what else I have right here, they brought to us early, late, later on, it is the Smokehouse Burger. It has onions, lettuce, onion rings, bacon, and my meat is well, like medium well, and it's got fries. So I might take that and work with me tomorrow, which I need some of it. So this right here is uh, honey mustard. If you can see on the video, probably can, but I'm pointing at it though. And this right here is the ranch. Uh, Y'all yeah, know what ranch look like. So uh, let's get into it. We're just trying to do the video. And you see my wife don't waste the ranch. Don't talk about me, I'm sensitive. Oh, that blue. So how was it? Good. So what you got plans for tonight? So after tonight, we're gonna go home, we watch a little movie, do a little cuddle time. We don't have the kids. Thank God. Y'all, this is an advice for anybody who's in a relationship, whether you're married or you get engaged or you look at towards marriage. Always find time to have for you and your spouse to see if y'all still got that fire, that connection. You know, do it like a little date night or a movie night at the house. Whenever you have time, get off work. Go to a nice restaurant. Do it like what you're doing. We just get appetizers and we're sharing. Just to have fun. It don't take much to actually enjoy each other's company. No, no. We no. don't. Yes, thank you. Okay, what's your name? Morgan. Okay. This is our YouTube channel, so. Oh, no. Uh -uh. You don't want to do the YouTube channel? No. Well, this is our waiter. This is our waiter, Carmen. Okay. She don't want to get in the video, but she's a nice waiter. Hey, babe. See? <laughs> Thank you. And yeah, she's a nice waiter. Yeah, she's very, very sweet. She's weird like us. <laughs> this is a nice restaurant. The prices are reasonable and it's cheap. Mm hmm. You know? Mm -hmm. So this is like a cute little date night that we actually have. I still got my work clothes on. I still got my work clothes on. I work at a bank. Daddy better get that check. <laughs> so why is it men like to be called daddy? It boosts our testosterone and ego. So y'all think y'all be handling things and you're like, daddy, yeah. So why do I say it? Because daddy know how to piss it down. So what? Daddy know how to piss it down. Who was that? Let me tell y'all something with me. I'm telling you from the marriage experience. You call a man daddy? Honey, you get cars, furniture, bills paid. <laughs> Uh -huh. Don't do it when you're in the midst. <laughs> uh -huh. They get to work hard, honey. <laughs> what? Oh, these fries. So what? These fries are good. And they spice. They hurt in the back of my throat. I'm pretty sure you're not. The nachos is smoke. I like them. Have you tried it? Yeah. It's kind of smoky. Like my lips is burning. Mm -mm. It's got a smoke taste to it. Yeah. On the grill. Mm. Look at that. 
I want the cheese with it. Let me try with the cheese. Mmm. But you don't eat cheese though. I don't. Let me try Here with your cheese. It. Is it good? I'm just really loving like the, the loaded cheese fries. I like that taste, that yeah. tang that it has, like the barbecue sauce on there. Mm -hmm. I'm like so full cool right now. But I gotta have some of that onion ring though. couples class. Well, you know, you just kind of sort of work on like your breathing and you know, you work on like um, how not to be stressed with three weeks in and I like it because I feel like me and Chris have gotten closer. So, like, and then on top of that, you kind of sort of take like bits and pieces and you try to put it into like your everyday life and also, you know, towards your relationship, marriage, whatever that you actually got going. So, we have been going and next week, I think we're going to talk about intimacy, which we are so open as far as, like, you know, learning different other things. So I'm excited to know what more that we can do and put some stuff that we actually have a breathing homework. But every time I do my breathing homework, I go to sleep. <laughs> every time I do my breathing homework, I find peace and calm. I'm not, I'm not. Stress. But Stress I think down. you need that. You know, so you won't, like, forget or lose sense of reality. Like, really just taking time with no phone and just be able to, you know, just hear the natural air. Like, we just got so much stuff going on. Like, with technology and social media and, you know, people around us always occupied. You want to eat some of it? Yeah. The onion ring? Yeah. I might get me that on um, this. Okay. I don't want to eat nothing because there ain't no cheese in there. <laughs> Bye, y'all.